Yo. Yo, 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 yo. If you guys are tuning in, please say what's up in the chat. Let me know who hit on the infrareds today, guys. Let me see. Let me see them dubs. Let me know who hit on the infrared fours, y'all. EA. Who got EA? Let me know in the chat, guys. Let me know in the chat, man. All right. Let's see what the vibes are real quick. Appreciate you guys for tuning in. We just started the stream. Give me just a tiny sec to get everything set up for you guys. What is up, guys? What is up? Calvin's up in here. Aaron is up in here. George, what is up in here? If you guys are coming in, say what's up to me, guys. Let me know who's up in here and watching, man. Appreciate the five thumbs up already. Appreciate you guys. Shout out to Meg the Style. <laughs> Let me see. Vital says, what it do, BG? What is up, Vital? Lime, what is up? Ronald says, no. Ronald, you couldn't cop today? Let me know. Trip says, negative. Negative? Sheesh. Appreciate you guys for tuning in once again. If you guys are coming in, please let me know in the chat. I'm going to put a poll for you guys. I'm going to pull a poll for you guys. Appreciate you guys for tuning in, man. Thank you, guys. Let me see. Um, who hit on infrareds? On air Jordan for infrareds. Yes, sir. Okay. Boom that's the i mean that's the poll for you guys right there appreciate the eight thumbs up once again guys uh trip tz says first to hit the like nice appreciate the eight thumbs up guys thank you guys so much for hitting the thumbs up for me guys or hitting the stream uh the thumbs up kevin says bg now i got the travis scott air trainers and the brown i can rock it with travis scott jacket nice nice speaking of travis scott and whatnot check these out right here they're giving me chocolate vibes the air forces the air force mid chocolates how do you guys feel about these they, they seem pretty decent they seem pretty freaking decent appreciate you guys for tuning in once again guys appreciate you guys a thousand percent chris what is up and londy holy snap yo 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 just selling love and light appreciate londy for the 4.99 don't know appreciate you a thousand percent londy thank you so much appreciate that a thousand percent how'd you do this morning londy did you hit i can't remember i can't remember there's a lot of people that hit uh today though there's a lot of people that hit from what it seems like right now. No one's hit on the infrareds, but we had a ton of dubs. Once again, shout out to Londi for the donation. Appreciate you a thousand percent, sis. Thank you guys so much. Uh, Lime says, are the raffles for the same uh, phone runners up? Question mark. They all seem close for now. Well, it's funny how you asked that because I'm pretty sure there's some raffles up right here and ready to go for the Desert Sands. I did load up some raffles right here that are ready to go. If you guys need them, I got, I got you guys. There's people still coming in, so we're going to just wait for more people to come, and then we can give out all that extra info for you guys for uh, the Desert Sand Foam Runners as well as uh, Stage Hazes as well because they should be releasing tomorrow, but with all the late shipments and all that uh, for the U.S., it seems like they're going to be postponing the um, the Jordan 1 state, uh, yeah, Stage Haze. Thank you so much, Lonnie, for the donation once again. Appreciate you a thousand percent. Uh, Karsten says, got EA for the infrareds, but missed out. Ah, snap. Sucks, sucks to hear. But you still have a chance on the 15th, guys. If you guys missed out on uh, today's um, exclusive access, you guys should be having another chance on the 15th. And I remember someone in the chat yesterday or today was talking about the Particle 9s. And look, check it out. They actually loaded up right here on the sneakers app for the 21st in the U.S., so that's pretty dope right there. Those, I'm not so sure who asked me about it, but uh, Particles will be dropping on the 21st on Sneakers app. It's already loaded up and ready to go. Um, let me see when exactly. Yeah, so as far as for the infrareds, guys, the 15th of this month, the U.S. should be having a second crack at it. It's going to be a draw, but nonetheless, it's still going to be a second chance. And again, for this drop, I think it was about, what, 22 or 26,000 pairs that released via um, exclusive access. Somewhere around there, somewhere around that range. I can't recall what exactly was the number, but um, it was extremely hard to hit. It's always extremely hard to hit on exclusive access. So if you guys did miss out, guys, there's going to be a ton of ton of more opportunities to hit on infrared fours um, like this morning. Lime says, are the raffles for San Romans? Okay, awesome. So Lime already answered that. I'll get back to that very, very soon. Joseph says, yo, BG, I would have caught a dub on the infrareds, but I was super hungover and slept in way too long, so I missed my chance to cop with EA sheesh it's all good the 15th we got till the 15th that's our second opportunity and maybe even more raffles to come for the infrareds for sure 
Uh, George says, in eight hours, there's a raffle for the Onyx Foam Runners. Can't wait to take two L's. Don't say it like that. You most likely will hit. With all the raffles that we've been doing, there's at least a solid, solid chance of you guys hitting at least one of the raffles. At least one of the raffles. It's it's hard. It's hard to hit nonetheless, but very, very likely for you guys to hit, man. There's no way. There's no way. You guys can definitely hit. Uh, Carson says, uh, they're up on confirmed right now, the Foam Runners. Yeah. They're definitely up both both phone runners, I believe, right? If you actually check on the confirmed app, let me see what the vibes are on confirmed. Um why can't I find the app? Ah, here it is right here. Let me show you guys. It should be loaded up. It should be loaded up. Check this out, guys. So that's Gucci right there. Just now. Let me see. Go to home, refresh, and boom, right here. You do have the Onyx pair right here in 16 hours. And you have the draw that you guys can participate right here. So plenty, plenty of time and plenty of places to cop some foam, run, foam runners and very much profitable, man. Foam runners are very much in as well as easy slides are great for easy profit to be made. I don't know about long term investment, but definitely quick flips nonetheless. Uh, Londi says, nope, didn't get the EA this morning, but I've been entering all the raffles for the foam runners. Nice, nice, as you should, as you should, as I should as well. But I never honestly go for raffles, but I think I'm going to try. I'm going to try. I've been a little bit lazy. Again, I tried going for the raffles for the uh, foam runner onyxes, but it's just like when I'm trying to provide you guys information in the videos and stuff, I kind of like just lay back and just have you guys do what you guys got to do. And I just sit back and hope for the best on some of the apps that I'd be using like confirmed. I mean, I last time I hit on confirmed was mad long ago, but nonetheless, I just stick with one raffle and I hope, you know, I let Jesus take the wheel for that. Um, the oddball says I hit on the infrareds. How about you, BG? I already had two exclusive accesses and um, I couldn't get a third one today. So no, I did not hit on infrareds, but I'm super happy that everyone did. It did happen around 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I'm pretty sure I dropped the video yesterday about it saying 12 p.m., but we always checked at 10, 11, and 12 just to be safe. Once it struck 12 p.m., a bunch of people were talking about they hit, which is great. You see, as you guys can see right here, 26% of you guys already hit Sesso right here. Um, so I think if it's the percentage wise in the votes if i see it more than 10 or 15 percent i think that's a successful rate for hits for manual users that is so it's great to see that it's very much great to see um those that are tuning in i will be sh showing you guys where exactly you guys can uh cop some uh foam runners as well as the zen masters if you guys are truly truly interested in copying some zen masters guys there's still a draw in there on end if you guys want to go ahead and try to reserve a pair Entering the draw, it's going to be around like, what, $228 after taxes and shipping and all that. But I think it'll be well worth it if it's only going to be releasing in UK or EU, I should say. Um, I think it's going to be well worth it. But there could be a possibility these might be dropping in the US. We just got to give it some time. But nonetheless, if you guys truly want it, better safe than sorry. Go right ahead for it. Um, I think it's worth it. I think it's worth it if you truly want the shoe. As far as the foam runners, we do still have some some places that you guys can go for foam runners. I already listed up a couple. I think so. This is one of them. It's Packers shoes. Raffle open, ready to go. You have bait me. You guys go to bait me shop our link. Easy. You guys take it. Matter of fact, let me see. Yeah. Boop 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 boop. No matter of fact, my apologies, guys. You guys go to shop our link in bio. You guys click on the foam runner, and boom, it'll take you right there. So there you have it easy ready to go for bait me as far as i'm a Meniere, you do have the possibility of going for the front uh the foam runners the stage hazes as well as the um the visionaries or the volts as many uh call it and you do also have the desert sands right here as well um as far as social status as well you guys got the stage hazes you got the runners and you have where exactly is the um there we go booyah desert sand ready to go ready to go so right now we are building up our raffles or our places to cop some foam runners so if you guys are truly interested those are some great spots i will have the links ready to go later on in the stream usually i do end the stream with the raffles and all that information so that way i don't take them to don't take up too much of everyone's time and um you guys can just stay at the end and just click on all the links and i'll have it ready to go for you guys as well as apb store will be having raffle links as well or raffles, I should say. You do have them for the stage hazes, um, onyxes, and it's pretty much the same for every single place, really. So yeah, 
um if anyone has any other questions please let it be known and if you guys hit please let me know in the chat guys we love seeing manual hits and um just uh a great amount of w's man it's always great to see that uh busta the kid says going for eight raffles on onyx form runners on four on sand runners wish me luck let's hope man let's hope those are going to be great calm personals for sure and as well as for resale so cannot go wrong with foam runners right now cannot go wrong with foam runners i wonder what retail price is i think it's like around 90 dollars, if i'm not mistaken right guys 90 dollars for foam runners um ano says got infrared size 10.5 i don't need if someone wants okay not bad not bad i would suggest trying to sell it right away before uh the release date usually prices do go low as um as time goes on when uh the release is near so just keep that in mind don't wait too long and trying to sell it if you guys are gonna sell it go sell it that same day like today i would try to sell my pair today if i managed to uh cop a, a pair of infrareds but uh you said you have a size 10 and a half that's my personal size uh buy for 340 right now 305 let's see how it's going it actually went up right now would be the perfect time to pre-sell your pair if you have the chance to for sure for sure um nick crowder what is up i see you coming in slide dunk says thanks no problem um let me see who else is up in here guys if you guys are tuning in please say what's up tony says i hit uh justin james says hit the likes thank you so much justin if you're still here thank you so much slide dunk says where did the infrareds come out they came on sneakers app this morning 12 p.m eastern standard time that's 11 a.m uh central standard time and i think that's what 9 a.m pacific standard time so that's when they came out um, on us oh there's a scam like we call let me just end that um so yeah they dropped in us uh sneakers app let's see do, 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 do. yeah karsten already um answered that so where are the phone runners up besides confirmed so yeah like i was saying there's a couple of sites i will be dropping the link for you guys later on after the end of the stream i will have it ready to go just lined up for you guys so you guys can just click 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 your life away um but yeah we do have packers we do have bait me we do have ama Manier, we do have social status we do have apb store right now for the foam runners as well as stage hazes as well as onyxes so that's what it's looking like right now it's looking pretty pretty good it's looking pretty good there's going to be a ton of more raffles coming up soon these are just the beginning raffles so we're just going to stay tuned this is some of the research that i've done thus far remember guys i do not have any cook groups i do have friends that have cook groups and join cook groups and all that all that discord stuff but this is simply out of just doing research this is simply out of doing research and just doing my part just looking around and scrapping up as much as possible um let's see um, and if also, if you guys have any raffles that I don't know, please let me know. Drop it in my DMs on Instagram. If you guys want to follow me on Instagram, this is my official Instagram. Go ahead and DM me some raffle links or something like that so I can drop it in the chat. I'll check it up to see if it's a legit site. If it is, boom, I'll drop it for you guys right then and there. This is all for us, guys. It's free. We're trying to do this for the community. That's what we're trying to do, man. We're definitely trying to help every single person out without having to pay a fee or anything like that. We're, we're all just trying to look out for one another and buy some shoes, for sure. Um, let me see, about a hex says, Z Masters is a hard pass, only because I only wear tie-dye stuff. Okay, not bad. I do like the uh, Zen Masters though. I do like the Zen Masters, scale of one to 10, I'll probably give it a solid seven. My boy Christian is up in here playing some UFC. I'm gonna ask him, how do you feel about the Zen Masters? These are Zen Master fours, how do you feel about them? Scale of one to 10. Not the worst shoe. Um, like a good seven. I think it's seven. All right. So, so it's not my favorite, but uh, it's creative. And I kind of like the, uh, the the look that they have going for it. I don't really like the tongue. I don't really, All right. Uh, not bad. So he gives them a solid seven out of 10, which is pretty average. That's pretty average. I would give these a solid 7.5. I do like the shoe. Not as much for me for to say it's a must cop. But definitely, it's something different. It definitely pops, and I like the silhouette, so it does help out a lot. So I would say this is a solid 7.5 out of 10. Please let me know in the chat how you guys feel about the Zen Masters. If you guys are going to try to cop, if it's a must cop, let it be known in the chat as well, guys. Um, Vus says $90 is crazy for a foam shoe when you think about it. I bet it's only probably like what? That's probably like less than a dollar for them, don't you guys think? How much do you guys think? Um, adidas be uh making off of these foam runners man they they make thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars they're probably worth like a less than a dollar if it's made out of foam i feel like i've seen how it looks like before it's made like foam runners and they're like little tiny little dots from what it seems like 
Uh, fifth element just says kicks. What is up? Still salty from earlier. From what? From taking an L, man. Don't worry, man. There's a ton of ton of ton of chances for uh, infrareds, bro. Don't worry, man. If you're talking about infrareds, there's a ton of chances. There's gonna be a buttload of chances. Don't be upset. Don't be upset whatsoever, guys. Do not be upset. Um, Christian says, what's up, bro? What is up, Christian? I didn't hit on the infrared fours, but I did hit on first come first surf some marina blues at my local boutique where I live. Nice. Congratulations, Christian. And thank you guys so much for the 21 thumbs up. If you guys are coming in, please hit that thumbs up. It's going to help out the stream 1000%. Much appreciate, much appreciation for everyone that tunes in and watches the channel as much as, um, if you guys are new and if you guys are saying what's up, please let it be known in the chat. Let me know how you guys are feeling. Who hit? And thank you guys so much for blocking the whole naked thing going on right there. Appreciate you guys a thousand percent. Them spammers go crazy. Chico says, I hit on Dunks Reserve Saturday, which was two weeks ago. And I think I hit on some golden rods, but my shoes still haven't came in. Oh, not uh, not good. Not good. Um, Have they already updated shipping for you or no, Chico? Let me know. Let me know. Have they already updated shipping for you or what's going on? Jeremiah says, salutes BG and chat. What is up, Jeremiah? How'd you do this morning? I can't recall, man. There's a ton of W's. Look, even the percentage keeps going up. We're at 26% when it comes to those infrared W's, man. Shout you guys out for show. Uh, it says, Busted the Kid says, please drop the Bait Me Foam Runner link. I got you guys right now. I do not want to keep on dropping links left and right because it does take some time uh, for... Uh, for me to do so but i will drop at least the bait me app for you guys if you guys truly want it i got i got you guys right now just give me one second once again guys if you guys are tuning in say what's up in the chat hopefully everyone's been doing great um how's everyone been doing man it's tuesday tuesday not much going on uh like i said before earlier there was like you know the weather's doing pretty nice in new york uh it seems pretty cloudy so there's not much to really be doing per se but nonetheless nothing too bad nothing too bad cannot complain on this lovely tuesday boop all right i got you guys the link right here guys so if you guys are trying to enter and bait me i got i got a little bit i got you guys right now here we go boop right there so i just dropped the link for you guys um let's see screwed up tx says i don't need a cook group my boy uh, bg got me with the info and details for a small fee for free facts that's what i'm saying i mean no no pun intended if you guys want to join cook groups right ahead but what i'm trying to say is we're here to help out each other man for sure for sure you guys don't need cook groups but if you guys want to cook group, go right ahead i tend to do stuff without cook groups i do not as well as other people but i definitely do my part and try to secure my pairs as best as possible there's a little bit lazy me with these raffles that i don't enter which is why i mostly don't take as many w's but nonetheless we do get the info out as much as everyone else does so or at least we try to keep up as much as everyone else does so for sure gary says thanks for putting in that work appreciate you bro no problem gary no problem this is for us this is for everyone not just me so you guys know that this is our channel not just my channel so appreciate you guys a thousand percent and thank you guys so much for the 33 thumbs up little aj says is there any raffles on the stage haze yeah there's still some raffles up right here and there like i said before i will be dropping them soon um let's see so as far as packer it doesn't seem but for um Manier, there's still some raffles up going on or maybe is it a raffle or is it going to be released um first come first serve type of thing i'm not so sure but i do know that they're going to be dropping them on um Manier, and then you do have social status as well at 10 june 8th so that's tomorrow so if you guys are trying to cop go right ahead you do have apb store all that good stuff all that good stuff uh, let's see. So tomorrow, casinas, guys. I keep forgetting. You guys are not. You, you guys are not reminding me of casinas. We're not going to talk about casinas. So tomorrow, the casinas will be dropping on the sneakers app. How do you guys feel about those? I'm not going to lie. I'm going to definitely be going for the personal as well as if it doesn't fit to par for me on feet, then I'm going to definitely sell. This is a great personal as well as um, an investment purpose uh, shoe. So definitely would say you guys cannot go wrong with any size as well as um any colorway to be honest i think these hit very nicely on the feet on the feet i've seen people have them in hand and they look pretty pretty spot on um i'm definitely going to be going for them george says zen masters are gonna are a pass too expensive in price probably won't go double the retail 
Okay, not bad. Not bad. Shara says, yo, what is up, Shara? Welcome back to the stream. Smash that like button. It's free. Thank you so much, Shara. C. Diamante says, hit on those fours today. Let's freaking go. We love seeing manual hits, yo. Let's get it. Congratulations. Uh, Fifth Elemental says, I'm just a sore loser, but wifey's bringing some chinos. Pa, it's all good. Woo. Rick Flair. I feel you on that, man. I feel you on that, Elemental. Like I said before, the 15th will be our day to cop some fours, man. So don't worry um let's see vu says bg my friend didn't realize he got exclusive access for the infras until a eight. uh eighth period that sucks that sucks you should have you should have told them you should have told them to tune in on the live stream man we were ready to go at 12 we were ready to go steven says do you think the casinos will be a tough cop um i think it's gonna sell out definitely i think they're gonna be a draw right so let me actually look it up for you guys right now if it's gonna be a draw it should be if you guys want to let me know in the chat Please let me know. But I got I got you guys right now. I'm just going to pull it up for you guys. It should be a draw. There you guys have it. You do see some Stussy X Converses right over here. They loaded up at 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time as well as these Air Forces right here. I think they're called Venice or Venice, whatever you guys want to pronounce it. Venice. I think these are Venice. My apologies. Um, these are pretty dope. And I'm a sucker for pink. I told you guys already. I'm a sucker for pink. And I think... The quality on these with the suede, I think it's very nice. It's a very nicely done shoe. As well as the chocolates, too. I see what they're trying to pull out here. They're, they're really trying it right now. They're really pushing out these mids right now, and they're really doing a good job doing so. I think they look very much spot on. If it wasn't $150, I would have copped. But $150 for a pair of mid Air Forces, that's pretty fuck. I mean, oop, I almost cursed, but it's pretty freaking pricey. It's pretty freaking pi pricey. I'm going to probably pass on them, but we'll see how the hype goes around with these because no, knowing me, knowing me, I'm probably going to cop regardless. And someone asked me about when these are going to drop the 21st. They loaded up on sneakers today, the 21st. The Particle 9s will be dropping, guys. So there you guys have it as far as for that. Now the Casinas, here we have it. Appreciate you guys for tuning in. I'm on the sneakers app right now. It's gonna be via draw, as you guys can see right here, 0608, which is tomorrow at 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, which is 9 a.m. Central Standard Time, which is 7 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. So that's the time zone for the drop for tomorrow. As far as these are the two colorways, I do not see you guys doing bad for either or i'm starting to like this pair more than the other pair definitely starting to like the pair more than the other so i'm kind of wanting to grab onto this pair let me know in the chat which pair do you guys prefer do you guys prefer the orange pair or the gray pair let me know in the chat guys uh, appreciate that no problem casino stock will be low i expect yeah definitely 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 holy snap ernest got two accounts up in here what why is there two Ernests up in here what welcome back Ernest. what is up using both accounts to smash that like button thank you so much Ernest. that was tripping me i'm like yo what am i seeing twins right now in the chat uh mark chen says sub bg sub 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 what is up Ernest says yo uh love the soul me too me too out of the two i very much do like the outsole on the gray pair on the gray pair i'm a sucker for pink like i told you guys i think that pink is pretty nice um chico says it says shipped on nike app but when the, i click on the track shipment it says estimated delivery date check back shortly and uh say, uh says awaiting carrier pickup but it's been since like friday slash saturday sheesh something's up right there i feel like or let's give it the benefit of the doubt maybe they're just a lot of backed up going on for the shipments so um or for shipping services so Give it some time. Give it a couple more days and see what it goes. I give it till Saturday. If nothing pops up on Saturday that's moving or something, I would suggest you guys call. You you de definitely should call. Definitely should call. Um, using both accounts to smash that like button. Thank you so much, Ernest. Sam says, what is up? Er I mean, what is up, Sam? What is up? Hoping to hit on casinas and phone runners tomorrow. It's not satisfied with at least one. All right. Not bad. Not bad. Hopefully, you do hit on at least one. It's going to be a tough cop nonetheless. Like I said, one of my good friends in Hills um, told me that uh, Casina, the brand Casina in Japan or Korea, I should say, my apologies. Um, it's like the union for that uh, side of the region. So if it's as hyped as union over there, I can see these being a fan favorite over here as well. So it's probably going to sell out like hotcakes. Again, it's a draw. We, we should be having numbers of stock numbers for these shoes. So stay tuned for the live tomorrow morning because we will be doing a live stream for this drop. 
hopefully it's not as limited as i'm hoping it to be or expecting it to be if there is at least i don't know man it's gonna be i can see it's gonna be hard regardless i can see it's gonna be hard regardless because resale price is already up like above a hundred dollars at least minimum so if resale is looking too well it's gonna be a tough cop regardless it's gonna be a tough cop regardless but nonetheless sneakers app tomorrow you guys can take your guys's chances use as many devices as possible um, I think you guys have a great chance of hitting or cross your fingers, hope the sneaker gods bless up and you guys will be, uh, definitely, definitely will be, uh, hopefully you guys will hit, hit for the personal or for resale, uh, either or, uh, Kaden says, what is up Kaden? What is up? Trying to grow my channel. Any advice? Question mark. Consistency, Kaden. Consistency. We go live almost every single day as well as we post every day on this channel. And I think because of you guys, it's been helping out a thousand percent. You guys see that we are consistent we do this every day and we do try to do things for the people so uh yeah that's that's my advice for you uh the kick push 71 says bg and chat what to do what is up kick push 71 what is up nikolai says that's normal dot 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 for what nikolai um let's see carter says let late join but hit the force today exclusive access congrats carter congrats joseph says both are cool but gray is definitely more wearable definitely i can see it definitely i like shoes that sometimes pop so this is something that pops and it's out there so i definitely do dig it uh boyd says do you know if the infrared fours will fit smaller than the red thunders that's a great question for me fours usually are true to size so i definitely would think that infrareds would be true to size as well but i'm not so sure i do have red thunders and they fit true to size so and all my fours fit true to size. I don't know how you guys feel about it. Let me know in the chat if it's any different for you guys. But for me, fours fit true to size. Uh, Shah says, that's what um, happened to my dunk. Some locations slow. Yeah. Yeah. As far as for me, I never really have a problem with shipping. Usually, it comes in very freaking fast, which is, I'm grateful for that. I'm grateful for that. Uh, Landon says, yes. The Kick Push 71 says, BG, are you going for the Cobblestone Air Max 1? I mean, it's pretty dope. It's cool, right? I kind of dig. I kind of do dig it, but at the same time, um, I don't know if I could see myself wearing that all the time. The the cobblestones they use right here. I'm gonna pop it up for you guys right now. I'm not so much of a fan of 95s. That's the thing. I'm not so much of a fan of 95s like that. Uh, 190 is very very expensive too, in my opinion. My opinion, it's kind of cool. Nothing too crazy. Um, it's just a simple 95 with some suede on the toe area. The color blocking is calm and subtling, so I get that. But for 190 right now, that's very expensive. That's very expensive, and if I can't make revenue off of my shoes that I'm wearing for personals that I can sell afterwards, then I'm not going to go for them. Uh, I want 95s. Nice. You guys think they're fire too? Nice, nice, nice. Uh, let's see. Nikolai says, I got my infrared on exclusive access. Nice. Congratulations. Congratulations, Nikolai. I love to hear it. I love to hear it. I think earlier today, I'm pretty sure most of you guys were here. We actually were giving people shout outs for them showing us our dubs on sneakers app. And we went crazy. It was a great time. If you guys actually want to send me your guys' screenshots, I could definitely pull it up and give you guys a shout out as well. But we tend to do that. We're, we should definitely start doing that for each live stream. Once we see them hits coming, we just send the dms on instagram and i'll give you guys a shout out for every time we hit on a shoe on the stream so that would be amazing i think we're gonna start doing that trend up in here for sure for sure i think it's great vibes knowing that people are hitting and um it's not so much as rigged as people may call it uh my order is pending for jordan one stage hazes nice not bad not bad where'd you uh where'd you try to cop your stage hazes voice says the almond choose brick and not gonna lie yeah it's not listen guys as far as air jordan 2s right now they're not the most hyped up shoe i really do like my pair of twos but but they are pretty much bricks as how many people call them but if you guys hold these on for the long run i can see these going up in value anything alma manier collaborations the union collabs i think they're gonna go up over over time right now we're at like a stock i mean we're at a market crash right now going on so every everything seems to be breaking unless it's not a hyped up shoe like a hyped up silhouette that's popping like a dunk even dunks are starting to go down in the market but you know something like a jordan 4 everything seems to be going up when it comes to jordan 4s nonetheless the prices are still low but i would say right now it's a buying market like you guys got to buy whatever you guys want now because sooner or later they're just going to shoot up in price later on 
as far as you just reminded me of the trainers a lot of people saying that trainers are bricks um the trainers the travis scott trainers that released a while back um not even a while back but a couple of days ago i should say or weeks ago whatever you guys want to call it um i think that these are bricks but these would be a great solid long-term investment in my opinion i think so too anything travis scott usually sells like hotcakes these are easy movers in my opinion um as much as how low it is i think you guys can very much cop yourself a pair for the personal and see what it does in the future because i do see travis scott shoes going crazy up in value uh, depending on how well his career does take off or uh, not even just take off he's been he's been on the grind he's been doing his stuff so anything travis scott usually does very well when it comes to shoes i suggest you guys pick up a pair if you guys haven't already this is a buying market right now it's not so much about selling it's about buying right now but if you guys are trying to make some cool calm cash you guys can always sell you guys can always sell you guys are not making as much money as you guys could if you guys hold it but who am i to tell you guys what to do i'm just giving you guys some calm little advice if you guys want to take it you guys can which is awesome if you guys don't that's your guys's decisions and i respect that uh did you get exclusive access for the fours rohan says no i did not i wish i did but i already had two exclusive access prior uh drop so um i knew i was pretty much done and thank you guys so much for blocking nick crowder thank you so much for uh blocking the the uh bots uh let's see the kick push says bg i'm talking cobblestone air max one not 95 drop. oh snap my apologies my apologies i actually haven't seen those yet i have not seen those kick push anymore. my apologies on that jesse says the jordan one mid i mean uh the jordan mid one gray releasing look nice 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 i'm not so much a fan of the mids but um there's some colorways that do hit different definitely uh blue dream says uh dang these draws should have been double pairs one ang's and korea usually goes as a pair as a gift newly married couples yeah i heard something about that where like the couples match within uh the different pairs or something like that oh would hate to hit on um would hate to hit one and not the other i feel you on that i feel you on that i think someone else told me about that which is pretty dope which is pretty cool let's hope let's hope we can hit on some casinos tomorrow Hopefully, if someone needs it more than I do, I'll definitely let it go for retail or um, just swap swap sizes or swap pairs if you guys uh, do need a specific size. Let's see. Uh, Prime 2 says spam. Yeah. See, I, I don't really catch the spams until later on. Elemental says low top twos is where it's at, especially for the summer. Pass on those AMA twos. They're going to do well like the playoffs or they're not going to do well like the playoffs 12s yeah i can see that happening i could definitely see that happening but in long-term investments i do think that twos will go up in value over time over over time for sure i can see it happening that is i can see it happening that is matter of fact they actually went up from last year to this year things actually went up over time when it came to the two silhouette i think i bought i bought a pair of uh twos for less than a hundred dollars and um i got it for a steel price i think they were the university reds or like the white and reds and um for 50 bucks that was a steel price i could resell that pair right now ever since they've been dropping the twos like crazy um i can resell that pair for about 120 to 150 easily if i wanted to so definitely look into twos if you guys want for the personal as well i i would say give twos a chance jose says is it safe to buy from stock x it's really up to you what you guys want to do when it comes to the apps, I think every app is safe. I really do. I really do think every app is safe. It's pretty much the same thing. Some people make mistakes within them. It, it's, it's. I mean, I don't know much to say about that. I think that every app does try to give us justice when it comes to um, selling authentic pairs. Ben says, Sub BG, you think Mama Cita's value will go up too? Yeah, definitely. Mama Cita's, without a doubt. Without a doubt. Mama Cita's, without a doubt, guys without a doubt these will be going up over time easily 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 give it some time guys i kid you not give it some time these will be going up this could be a two thousand dollar shoe in the future i give it maybe two to three years and i could definitely see it rising up above one, uh maybe 1400 1400 easily definitely uh suggestions for getting exclusive access on sneakers thank you guys so much for blocking the um the bots guys uh, secure the bag with foam runners onyx nice manny nice uh, suggestions for getting exclusive access on sneakers so when it comes to sneakers app and exclusive access it's very much randomized um some people are saying that if you are very much active on your sneakers account you might obtain exclusive access some people say don't use your sneakers app let it be like a ghost or whatnot ghost pretty much 
uh, go sneakers app and they'll grant you exclusive access to regain your interest on the app. I tend to be active. I tend to be active. Um, it worked for me two times, I feel like. But then again, it's just rumors. It's just things that are going on. We're not so sure. We're not so sure. Only Nike does know how the algorithm works. Uh, Jose says, or what else do you recommend to buy from? Question mark. Um, it's really up to you, man. I would say just buy from the store. That, that's why I, I tend to buy stuff just from retail now. Usually. Usually I just buy from re retail stores. That's how it goes. That's how it goes. If you guys want to really play it safe, try to buy from retail. And if not, then look at probably people that you know that have bought in it, that show proof that they've gotten it, they've gotten it from the retail stores and just go right ahead and buy it. You guys don't have to go off the apps. You guys can just uh, make connections, know people, see how they do things and see if uh, you can make some transaction with those people. Uh, BG Kicks, do you think the kind of uh, SB Dunk Lows was a good cop for retail to sell size 13? Um, any cop that's a dunk, that's an SB Dunk, is a good cop for retail, in my opinion. Especially for a size 13. Uh, the names extra says, ain't a reseller, but I might cop stage age ones before they get too expensive for my size. As of right now, I don't think ones are going to be growing in value like that because the hype is kind of dying down. But these stage hazes are very much clean. And I could very much uh, see a lot of people wearing them just because of how easy the colorway is going. It's easy to match with. It's a year-round shoe. I feel like Jordan 1s can be worn year-round. As far as the colorway, it got a little bit of suede. It got the gray. It got the black tail going on. Nice swoosh going on. I think I think it's pretty much popping. It's popping, and it's a low-value uh, shoe. So that's, that's great. That's a great plus. Great, great plus. The names extra says Anna resell. Oh, I already read that. Let's see. Star Patrick says, "How do you recommend we go copying on uh copying the foams? Uh, simple. Just go at go at as many raffles as you guys can to enter. Just go at as many raffles as you guys can. Let's see. Appreciate Bulldogs for tuning in. Let's run up the likes, fam. Appreciate you guys for tuning in. And please make sure you guys hit the thumbs up for us. Please hit the thumbs up." And um, it will help the stream a thousand percent. Let James says, "Damn, bro, you at six point two subs already? Ten k on the come up. Let's hope, guys, because of you guys, we've been on the grind and we've been growing as a family ever since we started going streaming. So appreciate you guys a thousand percent. Appreciate you guys a thousand percent. You about to be off this? All right, brody. All right, brody. Appreciate you. Yo, I saved that clip, bro. Yo, watch it when you get on stream. All right, bet. Awesome. All right, bet, bro." Uh, let's see. Brian King says the price, the prices on them are crazy. For what, Brian? For what? Let me know. Mr. Old School says, uh, smiley face. What is up, Mr. Old School? Bryce says, stay active. I've been given EA three times in one year. Nice, Bryce. I've been given EA two times as off of being active on this account. So on this device, I should say. Appreciate you guys for tuning in once again, guys. I keep reading all the comments, guys. So please be patient. If you guys have any questions, please let it be known in the chat, guys. Let it be known in the chat. Um, let me see if I can actually pull up Nike craft for us real quick because there is going to be a big drop on Friday and they still haven't updated anything when it comes to Nike craft, which is crazy. We got to know the time for that. Um, let me see. Let me see what you guys are. Um, in your opinion, what is the best sneakers to invest in right now that the market is down? Question mark. Dude, Jordan 4s right now, specifically the military blacks, as well as anything that's lower than 160 or 150 in price would be a great investment. Like dunks are usually around 100 to 110, depending on what, if it's a SB or if it's a regular dunk. Um, definitely fours and dunks fours and dunks are great as well as low ones as well as low ones jordan low ones are great investments easy to go to cheap retail and you guys can possibly sell for a high price so that's something to look forward to when it comes to reselling again i'm not a full-time reseller i'm usually right now i think i'm becoming a collector more than anything but i do know a lot about the market just because i was in that phase of just selling that's how i began i became I became a reseller that's that's how everything started up but as 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 time went off i actually started like really enjoying shoes and the culture within the shoes and stuff so i just decided like yo maybe it's time to back up from just selling 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 why not just start building up my collection so from i think i started becoming a collector um well here's the thing about me i don't try to pay resale so if i miss out on a shoe i tend to just go on to the next the next uh 
the next thing i don't try to pay resale for a shoe unless it's a must cop um, but I haven't paid resale in a quite some time. So we've been pretty good at that We've been saving money on resale, but nonetheless I'm not scared of paying resale and if I think it's a good investment in the long run I would be willing to pay resale no matter what um, Lil James says have you hit on Foot Locker or Champs for what as of as of late? No, I haven't I don't even go for Foot Locker or Champs um, I tend to not do any of those um, Any of those stores uh, Manny with the kick says those Jordan ones are making money uh, making cop and flip people Wait, wait, wait. Those Jordan ones, uh, the Jordan, blah, 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 blah. those Jordan ones are money making cop and flip people. Facts, very much facts. Uh, Lime says, in my opinion, if you ever had a Jordan one high because of the haze, is a good start for a possible retail price. Definitely. Let me see, Clarissa, what is up? Let's go 10k. Yo, guys, you guys are amazing. You guys are amazing for that. Thank you guys so much. We're close to hitting 10k. We're close to hitting 10k, which is insane. Let's see, YouTube BG. Let me see. We're so close to hitting 10K. Appreciate you guys. We're at 6K. We were just, I think we were just, we just hit 6K like two days ago. And look at how we're doing, guys. Thank you guys so much, man. Thank you guys so much. Stock number estimates for blueprints. Still unsure of what, how much stock numbers for blueprints. Usually I get that the day before or the same morning that the that they uh, release. So stay tuned for that. Jesse says, what do you think of the Dunk Racer Blues? I think they're great. Racer blues are really nice. I like the blue. I like the Kentucky vibes going on. Great, great investment and great for uh, personal. Michael says, I'm supposed to pick up my stage uh, stage age ones tomorrow from DTLR. Nice. Um, Brian says, the Kobe's. Jose says, I'm usually only buy for retail, but I haven't had any luck hitting this year. In due time. In due time. In due time. Patience. Sometimes taking a bunch of l's will give you guys that big huge w like for an example if you guys haven't been taking any dubs guess what guys you guys maybe have a solid chance at getting some travis scott reverse mochas that's going to be one of the biggest cops of this year maybe even the hardest cop maybe even the most hyped up drop of the year reverse mochas am i right you see it this way if you guys have not been copping any shoes for retail maybe this could be leading up to a solid w for the reverse mode because you guys got to be positive positivity guys positivity um will always be key when it comes to becoming a collector and stuff you guys will take a lot of l's but you guys will eventually get a nice solid w a lot of people got some solid w's today and they've never hit on sneakers or never got exclusive access they hit they hit today hit on the fours 10.5 let's get it vibration street let's get it uh, hit that like button people says shower thank you guys so much we got 66 thumbs up thank you guys so much for hitting the thumbs up for me uh blue widow says sup bro what is up blue widow welcome 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 to the stream um is there any upcoming drops that you guys want to talk about that I, I haven't spoken about other than the um let's see a lot of people have been asking me about the um louis vuitton drop the lv off-white drop uh, it's still unconfirmed guys if you guys were mentioning if you guys were one of the few people that were talking about the off-white drop i should be dropping a video again this saturday or this sunday about them i just gotta let you guys know that if in fact it does drop this month which is expected to um it's gonna be an extremely hard cop and it's gonna be a very limited drop and not just anyone can go for them not just anyone it's gonna be some some limited ass shoe to go for um travis scott reverse mocha is a fire shoe facts what phone runners dropping tomorrow question mark um the onyxes onyxes will be dropping tomorrow guys onyxes will be dropping tomorrow you guys can go for them on yeezy supply you guys can go for them on the sneakers app but majority let me actually just uh dang why are these um why are these uh bots out here going crazy um but yeah uh Onyx is tomorrow is going to be easy supply and confirmed depth. There might be another spot that you guys could go for first come first serve basis, but um, can't recall if tomorrow, but majority of the raffle entries that we did are pretty much done for as of right now, but there are some raffles up going for the, uh, for the desert sands that they started up today. Cause desert sands are supposed to be releasing Saturday, it's supposed to be releasing Saturday. Appreciate the 92 people up in here. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Uh, Mr. Custom says, yo, what's up? What is up, Mr. Custom? What is up? Appreciate you guys a thousand percent for always tuning in. Um, let's see. Jose says, if that happens, 
and I do hit for the reverse mochas, that would be worth taking the L so far. That's what I've been saying, Jose. That's what I'm saying. So if you guys have been taking so many L's, guys, trust and believe that you guys will have a big, 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 huge W coming your guys' way. I promise you guys. I promise you guys. It's just a matter of time. Just a matter of time. These bots are putting up numbers today. God dang. Yeah, facts. Facts. This one says, stop jerking cheaper than tender. Sheesh. Going crazy. They're really... Uh, yo, this bot is trash. <laughs> uh, Gary says, NYC stand up. Peace, BG. First time on the stream. You got a nice vibe going on. Thank you so much, Gary. Shout out to NYC, man. We're from New York up in here. Please let me know in the chat where you guys are located from. I am based off of New York, New York City was in brooklyn now we're kind of i can't really say now where exactly the area that i'm located at but just know we are in new york uh but i do uh have a heart for brooklyn that's where i went to school at and it's just a great vibe and it really did influence me when it came to shoes that's why i became a a collector now i really do feel like nyc fashion did um did influence me a lot in the game um ip soldier what is up do you think the reverse smokes will resell for 1k after resell like all other travis's ones do yes actually what i've been hearing guys what i've been hearing is that travis got mocha reverses or i'm sorry travis travis got jordan one reverse mochas it might end up being one of the most limited shoes for the public that he's released that's not a friends and family pair that's the rumor that's been going on that's the rumor if that's true these are going to be going crazy z guys i'm telling you guys it's okay if you guys end up paying resale for when it comes to the travis Scotts. it's going to be extremely extremely hard copy these as well as long-term investments i could definitely see them going through the roof through the roof for sure great question by the way ip soldier i love the questions there's no such thing as a dumb question up in this chat guys we're all here to help and we're all here to learn as much as possible um, and I'm also learning here too, man. I'm also here learning too. Michael says, Ohio, New Jersey, Texas, busted a kid. Uh, they will definitely be 1K. Yeah, definitely. I can see it. If it's less than $1,000, you guys scoop up your pairs right then and there. If it's less than $1,000, i am copping. I'm copping without a doubt. Without a doubt. If it's less than $1,000, i am copping right away. That's a great pair of shoes. It's extremely limited. You're not going to be seeing these every single freaking day. No, sir. No, ma'am no sir um are you close wait what do you mean by that shara um are you close to my dad i'm not so sure i'm not so sure um chanel says houston let's see nice shout out to houston brendan says easy phone runners is a great investment yes very much very very much um let's see but for only uh quick flips though quick flips i do not see them being a great long-term investment brendan fifth elemental says san antonio but born in brooklyn nice shout out to brooklyn move out move out here for work and school nice 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 uh Corderell says va shout out to va appreciate you guys for tuning in once again guys thank you guys so much for being active in the chat it's always great to see people feeling comfortable in the chat and letting it be known um, we're, we can always talk about everything up in here for sure. Do, do you guys have any questions about uh, shoes or uh, you guys want to let me know what you guys been up to today? Let me know, guys. Let me know. Appreciate you guys a thousand percent. As well as if you guys need me to follow any uh, pages on Twitter, please let me know if there's any places on Twitter that I can actually search up that I don't already follow to get, to get uh, info when it comes to... When it comes to... Um, when it comes to sneaker releases for sure dimitri says and my dad from bk isn't he question mark i'm not so sure i'm not so sure i never got the chance to meet him like that or to get to know him like that um Vos says i feel you bg i've never won a draw before and i've joined like 50. sheesh i think i have a chance to uh win something big sheesh i think so too i think so too if anyone hasn't hit in a while i'm telling you guys right now there's a great possible chance of hitting definitely definitely it's just a matter of time you guys got to take it one drop at a time um king says 68 likes let's go appreciate that guys appreciate the the 67 and 68 thumbs up up in here man uh king says i don't know if they will hit 1k gas high bills high the economy is bad right now people won't pay 1k for these in my opinion i could be wrong though king it's 
man, you'd be surprised, man. You'd be surprised. When it comes to these men, you'd be surprised. You'd be surprised. I think these are one of the better colorways when it comes to the reverse, uh, when it comes to the uh, Air, uh, Air Jordan 1s, to be honest. Not to mention, we can we can leave it in the chat. Guys, let me, let me ask you guys a quick question. Would you guys rather go for the reverse mochas or the fragments? Would you guys go for the reverse mochas or the fragment low ones? Let me know in the chat right now. Please, let it be known in the chat. Tell me reverse, tell me fragment in the chat right now. Which one would you guys go for? Which one is the better pair in your guys' opinion? I got to know for myself. I really do think that these are going to be in a $1,000 shoe no matter what. No matter what. Um, Demetri says they won't come out gate less than 1k, but they could drop. Uh, Chanel says follow sneakers huddle. I think I already do follow them, but let me check just in case. Sneaker. Do I follow? Follow. Thank you so much for that. Boom. Follow. Okay. Boop. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. Depends on the price. Mocha's no question. Fragged mocha's hard question. Not gonna lie. Reverse mocha's sheesh. She 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 since it says reverse mochas if people say fragments they're blinded by nostalgia or something. No, nah, I don't think so, man. A lot of people do like blue, a lot of people do like the, the fragment colorway. So do I, but I gotta say, I gotta say reverse mochas for me. And there's no no judgment. There's no judgment whatsoever. It's a tough question. It's a tough question nonetheless. Nonetheless, it's a tough question. Great shoes, but I'm gonna go with reverses. I'm going to go with reverses. I think it's the solid, solid pair that I could rock almost every day. The color blocking, I love it. Um, I do like the little age. I mean, it seems like every uh, midsole for Travis Scott's are kind of somewhat aged a bit, which is a great touch to it. But uh, I just, I'm a sucker for some brown too, man. I'm a sucker for some brown. Paxton says mocha. Michael says fragment low ones are one of the worst looking shoes I've ever seen. LOL. Uh, met for lane eight at the local bowling alley. Sheesh. Don't disrespect. Come on, Michael. You can't hate on the uh, frags like that. I do like them, but I get it. I get it. If you truly believe in that, I respect it. Uh, Paxton says Mocha, Mocha's all the way reverses. Okay, okay. So it seems like a lot of people, it's it's mixed. It's mixed pretty much. A lot of people are saying Mocha's though. That's tough, but Mocha's. All right. So here's here's my question. Here's my question. Does does anyone think reverse Mocha's are better than the actual Mocha originals that popped up? So you guys see the reverse Mocha's. Now let's talk about Travis Scott Mocha Lowe's. Okay, now let's talk about these bad boys right here. Would you guys pick these over the reverses? Let me know. Let me know. We got the reverses or the original mochas. Let me know. Type OG mochas, lows, and type reverse mochas. Let me know in the chat. Let me know in the chat how you guys truly feel about this. This is a, a, a toughie for me. This is a toughie for me. I'm probably going to tell you guys after I see what people... um. What, uh, what 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 you guys think what you guys think i don't want to influence you guys right away or something like that but i do i do think i have a strong strong feeling about one shoe in particular let's see michael barger is laughing uh synth says yeah i'd say uh they will diego wait did i miss something bust the kiss of the dark side uh made me follow them on ig in order to join the raffle sheesh uh, without nostalgia, there wouldn't be Jordan Brand. Sheesh. Facts. Snapple facts. Danny's voice says Michael isn't wrong. <laughs> um, Diego says, are the blue raspberries going to profit? Question mark. I think so. I think so. I think anything out of those SB dunk pack, the fruity pack, will be profitable. Matter of fact, I've been seeing green apples for uh, raffles up as of late. I should be dropping the, I should be giving you guys more info on that soon, but um, only for in-store raffles, I believe. Uh, Nick Crowd says reverse is better. Um, nah, they ain't that bad. But the hype with fragment lows gets make uh low gets makes no sense to me. Fifth Elemento says one hundo. Miguel says reverse for sure. OG lows reverse OG. Does anyone know when the four infrareds are dropping in the EU? Sam, I should have that info very soon. But right now, I'm not so sure. Uh, reverse, reverse, reverse. Dang, dang. This is a toughie, guys. Mister Old School says OG. 
Danny's World says the original mochas and regular mochas look like bum shoes to me. I don't ride high. I feel you on that. Mr. 510 to 949 says, no huge fan of low ones. Travis Scott is overrated. Just like these shoes, if there's a name wasn't attached to it, it would sit. OG mochas are better of the two, though. Okay. Understood. Understood. Mark says, OG, but I don't want to spend all that money. I feel you on that. Corderell says, OG. Elemental says, bum shoes. Clap, clap. Um, I wouldn't rock either color, to be honest. All right. Understood, Jess. Uh, let's see. Uh, Vuss says, imagine how the guy who hit on the off-white Chicago ones on sneakers is feeling. Imagine. I would wish. Uh, Diego says, profitable on StockX, though, right? Question mark. Um, wait, what do you mean by that, Diego? You mean like buying them off of StockX or selling them on StockX? Seems like it's kind of hard making profit right now if you guys are selling through the apps. I would say in person, though. I would say in person. Um, opinion on infrared fours. I think they're dope. Those that hit congratulations on infrared fours. I think they're very much dope. Um, but they're not the best fours. They're not the best looking fours, but they're still dope. They're still dope. I'm telling you guys, they're fire, but they're not the best looking for. They could have, not saying that they could have done better, but I'm just saying it's not the most favorite pair out of fours, I should say. Uh, nonetheless, it's dope. It's dope. I'm not a fan of infrared. That could be the reason why I don't dig them like that. But uh, they're a solid shoe. They're a great shoe. They're a great shoe. Uh, Buster the Kid said, I heard on Hypebeast that the reverse mochas are going to be a low and high silhouette. Sheesh. You, yo, if that's the case, if there's a high silhouette for these reverse mochas, who's going to, is that a better, a better looking shoe than the original OG highs? Nah, I don't think so, right? I think I'm going to have to stick with the OGs. I would have to see the pair first. If they come out with reverse high mochas, that, I, I'm going to need to see that. What do you guys think, chat? What do you guys think? Do you guys think if they drop reverse high mochas, they would uh they would be a better cop than the uh, originals OGs? Uh, Danny's got a mind of his own. Let's go, lol. Um, let's see. Uh, the hyper panda dunks is the most senseless, lol. I feel you on that. They're very overhyped. They're very overly hyped. I get it. But they're easy to go with anything, though. That's why they sell, right? You'll be dropping raffle links in the chat later on, right? Because I missed it. Yes, hype, hype is, yes. I do have some links up in here. After the stream is over, I will have the uh, the the, uh, the links out for the stream. So just stay tuned for that. Stay tuned for that. We'll be having links for you guys very, very soon. Uh, yo, are the Yeezy Onyx runners profitable? Yes. Any foam runner right now should be profitable. Yes, guys. Danny's World says military force midnight navies are the so are so sexy. Yo, I've seen them. I've seen them. If they come out how they're looking at right now, definitely gonna be a problem. I already have my military black fours, so I can pass up on them. But definitely, nonetheless, if you guys do not have military black fours, you guys want to wait it out till the uh, midnight navy fours. That would be a solid, solid pickup. IP Soldier says infrared looks better in photos. Um, was a little disappointed seeing them in hand. They can't, uh, they can't touch the military blacks. Okay. That's a solid, solid, um, solid, solid statement. How do you guys feel about it? How do you guys feel about that as well, man? Let's see. Um, dude, send the links for the raffles. I've been waiting at eight in the morning. Like, please, man. My apologies, Damien. The, their raffles that, uh, their, their raffles, they have time. I'm gonna miss them. Damien. So as far as for the onyxes, for the onyxes, right? Um, they're already done, but we're talking about raffles for the desert sands. So you're good. You still have plenty of time. Desert sands raffles won't end till probably two days from now. They, these are just fresh. These are fresh. You got it. Don't worry. The raffles that I'm having up are for desert sands only regardless. So, uh, we're still going to have to wait on it. Still have having to wait on it. My apologies on that, Damien. Uh, the kick push 71 says mocha. I says the foam runners. Jesse says, unpopular opinion. I would rather wear pandas over any Travis Lowe's. Really? Wow. You're the first that I ever hear that. Uh, for sure. Thanks, bro. No problem, Hypus. No problem. And then, guys, if you guys are new here, please subscribe to the YouTube channel, man. We tend to go live every single day, man. We try to provide as much info as possible when it comes to drops, as well as we can just chit chat and talk about shoes in general. In general, man. Let's see. Mr. Old School says, did you talk about the Jordan 9? on uh sneakers yes mr old school so 
the particle grays will be releasing on sneakers app i can actually pull it up right here i don't have to so much go on my phone but uh yeah check this out i know someone asked me in the chat oh my apologies on that i know someone asked me in the chat i also gotta check the battery life cool shout out to meg the style um let's see someone was asking me about the particle grays they're not loaded up anywhere well now they're loaded up on sneakers today they loaded up today 10 a.m eastern standard time on the 21st of this month so if you guys are trying to pick these up go right ahead i'm personally going to pass up on these i already have uh some nines i don't really necessarily want to spend 200 on some nines right now they're pretty dope but for 200 that's a little steep that's a little steep you feel me uh, let's see. Appreciate you guys for tuning in once again, guys. The watcher says I hit two military blacks and got EA today. Hit 9.5. Woo hoo! You on a rush? Uh, Pandas is super overhyped. Uh, no, you're fine. Understand? I'll wait. Okay, awesome, Damien. Thank you so much for your patience. Hit the like button, people. Thank you so much, Shara, for always um, reminding people to hit the like button. Thank you so much. Michael says, bro, have you seen the photo of the sample fragment highest compared to the official release? Question mark. It's sad. Lol. No, I haven't. How are they looking like? How do those look like? Uh, Damien says pandas are bricks. No, what? Not at all, Damien. Pandas are the unbreakables. They can never break. They will soon break if they keep restocking this left and right, which they will. So um, just a matter of time. But if you guys have a pair of pandas, I would not hold on to them. I would try to sell right at, right away, right away, to be honest. Uh, Mr. Old School says, okay, I missed the start of the stream. Oh, no problem, Mr. Old School. As long as uh, you, you guys just have to remind me, that's all. And the kick push seventy one says reverse mochas, nice and nice, nice, nice. Busted the kid says, can you look up the reverse mocha highs and tell me what you think? This is gonna be the first time I ever see the reverse mocha highs. Let's see, reverse mocha high ones. Let's see what the vibes are with those. Holy, this is definitely a custom made shoe. Like this is not even. I guess this is except all. I guess this is like, if this is actually what might come out, if this is an actual picture, I don't know, man, I'm digging, I'm digging the, um, I feel like I've seen him rock some type of Jordan one like this before. I, I think I've seen uh, Travis Scott rock something like this before, but I'm not so sure if it was a reverse mocha. Um, if this actually does end up coming out, I don't know, man, I'm digging the OGs more. I'm definitely digging the OGs more. I wonder what the heck happened to all the tabs. Did I do something wrong up in here? What did I do with the tabs? Did you guys see that? The whole tabs just ran off. It's all good, guys. I still have the links ready to go for you guys when I end the stream. So don't worry. Uh, Michael says, sent you a DM. Okay, let me see what the vibes are. But as far as for these, right, guys? My apologies, guys. As far as for these, right, guys? If they ended up coming out with these, I'd rather prefer the OGs. That's just me. But let me know in the chat what you guys think about these. Would you guys rather go for the reverse mochas or the OGs? Let me know in the chat right now. How would you guys feel about these? It's okay. There's no wrong answer. It's your guys' opinions. I'd rather go for the OGs rather than the reverse mochas. These are not so much appealing to my eyes right now. I prefer the uh, reverse lows, to be honest. Uh, should I sell my Jordan Legacy 312 lows? I've never heard of the Jordan Legacy 312 lows, but um, if you, it's up to you, really. It's up to you. I don't think um, you can make a lot of money off of the Jordan Legacies. I've never even heard of Jordan Legacies, to be honest. But um, you should definitely sell them if you're trying to make some quick money. That's all I got to say. If you like them or if you don't like them as much, you guys can definitely, definitely sell them. Uh, when are the pandas dropping again? Question mark says Ryan. Still unconfirmed of the date, but they should be dropping this month, nonetheless. Nonetheless, uh, Fifth Elementary says pandas look better in ladies. Will not rock those. Oh, you don't you don't mess with pandas like that? I would only rock high top pandas, in my opinion. That's how I feel. That I tend to just rock high top pandas or high top pairs usually, usually unless they're those uh, reverse mochas. Then definitely, definitely would go for them. But um. Let's see, Vu's true, uh, but it's only $90 profit. For what, guys? For what? Can you look up the reverse mocha highs? Reverse. Did I miss anything? Fifth Elemental says, the bump shoes before those kicks. <sighs> um, who's going for Jordan 1 Haze? Yeah, so as far as for Jordan 1 Haze, I'm going to be passing up on it, Mr. 510. Who here is actually intrigued with the Jordan 1 uh, Stage Hazes? Let me know in the chat, guys. 
let me know in the chat who's actually going to be going for stage hazes. I know I got to pass up on it just because I have too many, too many Jordan 1s now. And I already have, like I said before, I got Shadow 1s, Shadow 2.0. So they look too similar as well as I do have NYC to Paris's. So they, they just look way too much, too much similarities. I'm going to be spending another $170, $180, $190. I can't recall what retail price is for these. Retail was $170. So I don't know, man. I think I'm pretty much done unless it's OG colorways or hyped up releases like Travis Scott's. Really, 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 really. Danny's World says, I am. Nice. Splitter says, I'm entering stage hazes. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. That's a solid shoe nonetheless, guys. Stage hazes are really nice. Stage hazes are definitely, definitely nice, guys. Let me see. Uh, Mitchell says, got a W on the stage haze. Nice. Congrats, Mitchell. Congratulations. Twin says, pass. You guys are passing up on these? You guys are passing up on these? Um, I'm actually hyped up for them, as you should, Danny. As you should. Just Panther says, I caught the Nike SB Dunk Clothes Valier Blues yesterday. Congrats. Where'd you cop? Did you cop off resale or retail? Let me know. Elemental says, pass on the stage haze. I'm good with my diamond mitts. As you should. Nice. Those are solid pickups as well. I like the way they look during, with uh, with some light flashing on them. They definitely do have some kind of glimmer going on. Rosie, what is up? Can't wait for the Supreme X North Face this week. Solid stuff. Yeah, Rosie, I will be dropping a video tomorrow about it. I have been procrastinating with that video just because I'm trying to make a video that's less time consuming for when it comes to my viewers. I do try to make videos very short. But tomorrow I should be making a calm little four minute video of what's the best uh, items to go for uh, Supreme this week. Speaking of which, we can actually look at some right now. But um, I can tell you that Supreme TNF really disappointed me. I feel like there should have been more good stuff up in here. But I mean, it can't always be a banger, right? Um, I think out of the whole drop, I do like this bandana tee, um, the hats. The uh, convertible jackets are nice, but they're very much pricey. Uh, the slides are dope, the black pair of slides, and then the crew neck. This is probably my best, best solid item of the drop. This right here, that crew neck right there goes hard in my opinion. The cream colorway, the navy colorway, and the pink colorway. The black, you can miss me on that, but these three colorways right here, they go hard, man. They're a beautiful, beautiful crew neck. They've done a really nice job on those. Too many, uh, black and white shoes out pandas and militaries yeah i feel you on that twin but military blacks are just whew. i gotta i gotta i gotta tell them I, nike did their thing jordan did their thing with those military blacks i caught them retail sneakers app man nice so you must be located in eu nice that's what so we actually went live for eu for that drop man maybe you were one of those people that uh that were in the chat that one day i can't recall i can't remember uh, Danny's World says, I got some diamond mids too, but I got them five, uh, 0.5 size smaller. And I feel like I should return them. Just rock the stage hazes. If you really do feel like it, go right ahead and return them. That's what's great about Nike is that they accept free returns. I'm not so sure if you caught them off of Nike, but if you did, they do accept free returns. So that's always great. Uh, you've seen the Adidas Gucci collab? Yes, I have. It's a little iffy for me. I'm not so much of a fan of designer like crazy like that. Um, we can actually check it out right here. Definitely check it out right here. View collection here. Let me put you guys onto the phone right here. And boom, we're on the phone vibes. View collection. Let's see what's happening over here. Swipe up. 18 items. You got the tops. Um, When do these come out? I'm still unsure of when exactly they will be coming out. We got some tees right here. These are calm, but nothing too crazy. Holy, look at that sweater. These prices go crazy. I'm not trying to spend that much money on these. What? How do you guys feel about the Gucci and Adidas collab? They're crazy with the values right now. Thirteen hundred for the sweatshirt. Holy frick! That's insane. The shorts look kind of go hard though. One thousand two hundred dollars though. Sheesh! Holy! Holy! Golly! Oh, the bucket hat, Gucci bucket hat, Gucci bucket hat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna have to pass on them, guys. I'm passing up on that. Ooh, that baggie does look nice. I gotta pass up on it though. From what it seems like, it's too pricey. Too freaking pricey. Do you guys see him? That's tax. 
tags. How do you guys feel about the Gucci and Adidas collab, man? It's too pri too pricey, guys. Would y'all pay three hundred dollars shipped for ten point five military blacks? Yes, sir. Brandon, I would pay three hundred shipped, no doubt about it, for sure. Size ten point five, that's my size. I would, yeah, definitely run up a three hundred dollar uh, shipped for those, definitely. Are the Air Max One blueprints a cop? Definitely, I got me a pair as well. Blueprints are definitely a cop, in my opinion. They're gonna go up in value over time. That colorway, the outsole, the Air Max One, I can see it going up over time. I can see it over time. Hopefully, if they don't keep restocking how they've been doing with every shoe, but we're gonna see. Uh, yeah, Brandon, that's money size. Uh, the Pick and Chief says two fifty plus, uh, for some socks, right? That's insane. That's insane. Insane. But says they bugging one thousand one hundred for the short shorts. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm crazy for buying a hundred dollar pair of shorts, but a thousand three hundred dollars for a pair of freaking shorts, that's steep. I do rock Eric Emmanuel shorts. I I love them. They're overpriced, but they're still dope in my opinion. But come on, a thousand dollars? That's a big difference from a hundred dollars right there, man. I'm not trying to pay that much. Uh Elemental says must cop Brandon facts. Got my personal size 12 for 300 chip. Holy snap, Nick. You did great on that. That's a money size too, man. Splitter says stage haze must cop. I'm making profit because it's store raffle like 25 bucks size 10.5. Nice. Okay. That's what I'm so. Brandon says buying as you should. Uh, Nick Crowder just gave us a link for what, Nick Crowder? What link was that? Thank you so much for always providing links in the chat, guys. My mods are the best out here. They do show us love when it comes to dropping links when it comes to upcoming raffles when it comes to drops all that type of stuff shout out to the mods man they don't have to but they do so thank you guys so much uh tito wit says w times two on early access infrareds let's go congrats how'd you get two times how do you get early access two times how do you have three different devices two different devices that hit at the same time how do you do that that's insane ryan says uh where are the stage changes dropping Okay, so as far as stage hazes, I will drop the link for you guys. I'm pretty sure Alma Meniere should be having some, but let me check right now, guys. I'm pretty sure Alma Meniere, Bait Me are one of those sites that should have uh, stage hazes. Um, let me see what else. Let me see what else, guys. I'm going to just drop you guys the link right now if I can. So let's start out with Alma Meniere. Appreciate you guys for tuning in once again. We're going to go to Ama Minier. Like I said before, guys, by the end of the stream, I'll drop some link for you guys when it comes to the uh, um, the phone runners. So you guys can enter up. Again, I don't know why what happened with my tabs, but they just deleted everything. And I always have a problem when it comes to Ama Minier trying to log in. Seems like that, that site always gives me a problem. Daniel Swole says, one thing I noticed about the Military 4s, though, is that they have the glued front, which you can see a little. The stage haze has stitched. Oh, wow. I did not see that at all. Did not see that at all. Great insight. Um, I hit on Kith for the foam runners. How, Santiago? How? That's a great hit. What says amazing stream BG kicks? Thank you guys so much, man. I do try my best. But like I said before, guys, I will be giving you guys the links after the stream is over. I will let the stream run and I'll drop you guys the link. It's very difficult for me to run the stream and drop links at the same time. But uh, nonetheless, I will be providing you guys, like I said before, Sage Hazes should be dropping on Alma Minier. As well as other sites, I will be dropping the links after the stream is over. If you guys want to stay and click on those links after I'm done, I will do that. In fact, and if you guys are new, subscribe to the channel, man. Once again, we, we're always going live for uh, upcoming drops and live cops, man. So if you guys are truly interested, go right ahead. Um, I made a new account because I lost my login and hit on new account. Then remembered that my login info on old account and hit. Holy snap. The luck of the Irish is crazy. Uh, Chris Cubbin says, what's good, BG? What is up? What is up, Chris? Welcome back to the stream. Al says, can we use different debit cards with the same name on different sneakers accounts? Of course. You guys can use different credit cards. It's just, um, it's a little iffy when it comes to using the same address you guys got to somewhat tweak it up a bit so it doesn't flag it like multiple entries for the same uh as like multiple entries as the same person per se but just try to tweak up your address here and there um gaming nah nike will know um wait let me see um when you're in union are impossible to hit on raffles yeah i feel you on that but it's almost impossible to hit on everything because everyone's doing raffles in general so uh, it's just a matter of luck and patience guys 
just a matter of luck and patience let me just hit you guys with the quick little oh uh, oh my gosh hopefully uh that light go crazy um hopefully that's better if not i'm just gonna turn on the regular light i gotta see it from right here oh my gosh let me see if i can do this that should be a little bit better that should be a little bit better. Um, enter raffle for easy phone runners on Amma Manier. Yeah, thank you so much for that. Guys, mods, if you guys are here, if you guys want to drop links for the uh, phone runners right now, before I do so, you guys can right away. Um, but uh, as far as, I will be dropping the links for you guys very, very soon. Just give me some time. After the stream is over, I will drop you guys the links. Uh, Nike doesn't care about the address. They don't? You don't think so, K uh, KJ? Uh, Tito says, I want to hear something funny, though. My old account has old addresses, so kind of nervous. Never changed it. I mean, the odds of you hitting twice is very hard, so I don't really care about the address as much anyways. I hit on foams. Nice, Zillow. Nice. Congratulations, guys. Those that hit on foams, let me know who hit on foams. And who has a pair of foam runners, too, guys? Who has a pair of foam runners? I've never actually managed to cop me a pair of foam runners. Never really had them in hand. Never really known how they feel. Can you guys let me know in the chat how they how they are in person and um um how the fit is man for sure brandon says i've only hit once on social status raffle and it was on 10.5 concepts heavy that's still a hit man that's still a hit you said you said that you hit on social status a lot of people have not hit on social status so that's a great hit uh Vos says kg yes they do literally every youtube says they tweak up the address just to be safe though guys i say you guys have to tweak it up just a tad bit just a tad bit for when when it comes to sneakers app right when it comes to nike you're only supposed to have one account you're only supposed to have one account so it's best to just tweak your address just a tiny bit in case um they they suspect something if they add up the ip addresses that's in your guys's location they think that there's multiple accounts trying to do the same thing it could it could cause a problem it could so it's better safe than sorry now i hit on two monthly blocks two different accounts the same address and name yeah but like i said before guys it's always best to play it safe just in case they cancel orders but i've done that exactly too like i don't really care about the address as much but um i have the stone sage and they're really comfortable nice they better be comfy <laughs> Demetrius says currently trying to sell stinky things lmao um let me see okay buzz you don't know ish chill guys chill 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 guys um like i said before everyone's entitled for their opinions please no negativity whatsoever keep it to where um we we um understand each other's opinions and uh, just leave it as that but like i said before i think that you guys should definitely tweak the addresses just in case but if you guys want to do what kg does i do that sometimes i'm sometimes lazy to tweak my addresses odds of you guys are hitting very difficult it's always best to use different credit cards it's always best to use uh credit over debit all the time just in case if something happens with your order you guys don't know where it's at you don't necessarily have to worry about your money you're worried uh, it'll be the credit the uh, bank's um, problem if something happens with your order and stuff you don't have to constantly wait for that refund um so yeah just giving you guys some quick advice uh don't use the same card facts i would not use the same card i would always use a different card i have about four credit cards four credit cards ready to go uh, the new wave lee says thanks um appreciate you for tuning in the new wave lee how's everything jonelle says really comfortable they run small i recommend going a full size up oh, okay awesome awesome sauce for that mark says the made in Cham uh, china foam runs small go up a size made in usa uh pairs run true to size get your true to size go half a size up if you're a half a size for an example 8.5 get a nine awesome awesome thank you guys so much uh elemental says bro george straight replied to a comment I made on um, one of his videos. Wait a minute, what? Wait, wait, wait. Uh, George Strait replied to a comment I made on one of his videos. Wait, what do you mean by that, Elemental? I feel accomplished. Sheesh. Brooklyn says, what about the credit card that you use? Question mark. What do you mean by that? Can I leave my backpack in here? Sure. Wait, did you leave it in here? You yeah, said? My backpack. Um, no, it's, it was in the hallway. Oh, for real? Wait, wait. Yeah. It was just in the hallway. Okay, yeah, alright. All right. No, all right. All right, bro. Peace, Peace out. Guys. See you soon, all right? Bye, stream. <laughs> That's my friend Christopher, guys. Um, let me see. Uh, Vijay, Vijay, hopefully I'm saying this right. Uh, Vijay says, what's up? What is up, Vijay? Or Vijay? 
Um, Brooklyn says, what, a, what about the credit card that you use? Question mark. Um, what do you mean by that, Brooklyn? What do you mean by that? So as far as my credit card, I usually use Capital One or uh, Chase. And I tend to not use the same one. And I just go for different accounts with different different credit cards. Um, ask your baby mama debit card for the W on infrared for Father's Day. <laughs> what? Uh, Buster says, soft phone runners at the mall, they feel like Crocs a bit and feel airy and light. Nice. That's always great to have for uh, for something on your feet for sure. Uh, where can we find the foams? Um, so as far as for foam, guys, I will be dropping you guys the link. In case, Nick, if you're still here, please let it be dropped in the uh, in the chat. As well as Amamir will be having some foam runners ready to go. So if you guys want to go ahead and go to Amamir, I will drop the links for you guys after the stream is over. Don't worry, guys. I got you guys. Or we got you guys, I should say. Uh, the 350s are the ones that are tight on my foot. Sheesh. Yeah, 350s do really run tight, though. That's why I don't like buying Yeezys because they run extremely snug. Uh, Zilla says, what are the Air Jordan 1s dropping? Only US? Question mark. The thing about it is that the stage changes have a lot of uh, a shipping delays. So they might not even drop, but there's some raffles up in there that are based in Europe that you guys can still cop the stage changes. Uh, those links glitched. It's all good. It's all good. We'll drop the links before the end of the stream is over. Don't worry, guys. We will be dropping the links early. Just be patient. We're almost done with our um with the live stream anyways because i do have to go in a couple of minutes but we're still here up in the stream if you guys have any questions please let it be known in the chat uh do you like the jordan one visionaires um well it's funny that you asked that because it's right here i do own a pair of volt golds uh in my opinion it's not the best um i don't really like bolt like that like that colorway it's not the best colorway in my opinion but you know, it's pretty bright. I guess it's a nice summer shoe if you guys want to wear something with the neon colorways. You guys can very much go for it. I'm not going to be going for it. I'm going to pass up on it. I would love to hear from you guys how you guys feel about the Volt. Uh, I mean, I was about to say the Volt Gold, but the uh, Visionaires. How do you guys feel about it? Or the Volts, as many may call it. Let me know in the chat. Is this a cop or a drop? You guys can say cop or drop in the chat. I would love to hear from you guys. Um, Brooklyn says, I got a second joint. I made... Uh, but I never used, I added a credit card to it. That's not my normal sneakers out. Okay, not bad, not bad. By the way, when I said second joint, you really made me feel like I was back in Brooklyn just now. <laughs> you made a second joint, that's crazy. Um, love it though. Shout out to NYC for sure, yo. Shout out to NYC. Um, Lime says, with the foams, you gotta go full size up. Um, do Air Max run true to size or recommend going up or down or half a size? As far as for uh, Air Max ones, uh, for me they run true to size. I've run, I've uh, I've been wearing my blueprints or not haven't been wearing, but I tried on my blueprints and they feel perfect. So I would say uh, true to size, true to size. Demetrius says only pair I've hit on the on the way pair is defectively large question mark. Wait, what do you mean by that, um, Demetrius? Let's see. I like the Great Casinas Air Max ones more than the other colorway. Yeah, I've so as far as the two colorways for the Casinas. I think the gray colorway is growing on me more now, but definitely think that the outsole from the gray ones are way better than the uh, orange pair. Uh, Visionaires are too bright. Drop trash color. I'm going for both Casino Air Maxes. Let's hope you hit. It's going to be a tough cop for tomorrow, guys. It's going to be a, definitely a uh, tough cop. Uh, Brooklyn says, I don't like my chances. It's going to be a tough cop. Like I said before, they're probably going to be pretty hard to get. We should have stock numbers tomorrow morning, so stay tuned for that as well. Um, drop, drop, drop. Damn, it seems like a lot of people are dropping it, man. Uh, BG, do you like the Adidas Gonzalez Ultra Boost? I haven't seen those yet. I haven't seen those, and I haven't rocked Ultra Boost in quite some time. I forgot when's the last time I actually rocked any Adidas Ultra Boost shoes. Quite some time. It gives me, like, 2013, 2014 vibes. It's still great. I love Boost. I love Boost, but I haven't ca caught myself rocking Boost in a while. Nadine says, drop. Uh, Sharpie looking 21. <laughs> Visionaires is a bad shoe. What the F? There's some people that like this shoe, though. And wait, is this cracking on the bot or what? What is that to you guys? Do you guys see that? Is that cracking or something? Please do not tell me that's cracking. Please do not tell me that's cracking. I thought it was like luscious leather going on, like plushy. Ad. But if that's cracking, come on. I do not like that. Dropping those straight in the garbage. Um, I thought them. Let me see. 
Yeah, man. You know the lingo never leaves no matter where we go. That's a fact. That's a fact. Let me see. Shout out to the New York dad. Shout out to the New York dad. No doubt about it. Um, drop time. Drop times two for me. Facts. Facts. Uh, Helper, Helper Casino says, cop for the sis. Okay, not bad. I thought they weren't called the Jordan 1 highlighters. <laughs> I thought so too, but um, I guess they're called the visionaries or the volts. Uh, depending on where you guys are located. Uh, will I be able to get stage chase tomorrow in finish line or Foot Locker without EA? I don't think Foot Locker and Finish Line is gonna be um is gonna be having uh stage hazes just because uh, I think there's late shimmies going on and there's a lot of cancellations going around, right guys? Those that tried for Foot Locker and Champs and uh finish line, have you guys received uh cancellations for the uh stage hazes? Can you guys let me know? Um Shiz look like sticky notes. <laughs> um, Air Max 1s go true to size. Yeah, I would say so too. Uh, Mr. 510 to 949. Were they all black and make the vote pop? Nice. Brooklyn says, what's crazy is I'm a size 11 and a half Air Max 1s, but I don't have wide feet, so I can also wear a size 11 in Air Max 1. Not bad. I wish I could say the same. I, I have wide ass feet, so I have to go true to size. And if I go up a size, it's not going to fit me. So I have to stick with size 10 and a half, but I could really fit a size 10 and a nine and a half half and a nine and a half, but it would just feel way too uncomfortable. It would just feel like, wait, if it would feel like the shoe is about a pop type of thing. Crazy, 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 crazy. Uh, Chris Cubbing says cracked leather. Oh, is it really cracking? Same with the Chicago's. The Chicago's is a different though. Chicago's, it's like a, it's a, it's a vintage type of look going on. This does not have a vintage type of look. It just looks like they just put cracking leather just to have cracking leather. It makes, ah, uh, it's disgusting. That's what I feel about it. But nonetheless, some people actually like it. I get it. This would go crazy in the summertime, but it's not my cup of tea. Definitely not my cup of tea. Uh, Blue Knight says they're supposed to be the almost same materials as the Alma ones. Is that true? Is that true? Bears Jordans they are pushing have their that and it ended up getting played. Cracking? You mean just uh, chicharrones? Yum. <laughs> uh, Brooklyn says I want to win in store raffle. Oh dang! Um, I've even won a draw on sneakers. It's the only thing left in my sneaker life. <laughs> I feel you on that. I don't think I've won any. No, I have won raffles before. I just can't remember which ones. It's been a long time since I've won a raffle. Little AJ says, yeah. Jacob says, no, the whole upper yellow and the black will crack over time. Sheesh. Growing legit says, I've been wanting stage hazes for a minute. Stage hazes are pretty freaking nice. They're clean. Passing on vote. Okay. Uh, Ijo says, uh, the foam runner drop going to be bloodbath. I'm preparing to pay resell as far as for foam runners it's okay to pay, pay resell for the foam runners um i think they're gonna go lower than what they're at right now regardless so i think you guys have um if you guys miss out on a uh, a restock or a release i'd say buy them now because i feel like they might go up just a tiny bit they're gonna go up just a tiny bit my apologies guys my dog might bark let's go come on you want to go go good boy um, so as far as, uh, foam runners, I can see them going up in price because summer's coming up, but as far as long-term investment after the summer, I do not, like I told you guys, my dog is going to bark. Um, I do not see them being great in price. And here's comes the other one trying to be tough as well. Hold on guys. Come here. Come here. You is not barking right now. Okay. Um, let me see. So yeah. Foam runners are not going to be the best long-term investment, but as far as for quick investments, definitely would pick them up. And I would be willing to pay resale for foam runners because it is going to be a tough cop nonetheless. Appreciate you guys for tuning in once again. Uh, they look good. What's up with the Alma raffles just stuck on loading? Wait, are they really? Are they really? Does it glow in the dark? Question mark. Sarcasm. <laughs> um, Blue Knight says, rumor is the Air Jordan 1 reimagined is supposed to be the same materials. Oh, snap. Mr. 510, W with champ stage hazes. Oh, okay, not bad. Not bad at all, man. Not bad at all. Um, Had to pay resale on some dunks lately. Not too bad, but would love to pay retail. Yeah, definitely. Definitely, definitely, definitely. Um, Kelvin says, yo, BG, what's your thoughts on the Jordan 1 Elephant print that's released in spring 2023? Check them out, bro. Let's see the vibes with those. Jordan 1 Elephant 
elephant print. Talking about these? Or are you talking about these? Wait, are these the same thing? 2023. Let me just type it up. 2023. Just to be safe. I think he's talking about these, right? 2023. Oh, these are kind of nice. I do like the elephant print. I do like the elephant print, but not so much all around the shoe. But nonetheless, these are pretty dope. These are pretty dope. Javier says, any update on the Jackie Robinson dunks? Javier, if they are going to be dropping the uh, Jackie Robinson dunks on in US, it should be either later this month or it could be next month. Or it could be pushed to uh, August. But it should be dropping sometime during the summer. Sometime during the summer. Maria, it says, 300 for the shoe, kind of not good in my opinion. For which shoe, Maria? For which shoe? As far as for resale? Inho says, BG Kicks Live, best part of my day after a long day of work. Thank you so much, Inho. Appreciate you for always tuning in once again. How was work, man? And are you going to be going for the casinos? If so, which size will you guys be going for the casinos? Um, By the heck says, um, I have the original ele elephant print from 2016, $500 plus for a used pair. I rock mine to this day. Mines are white toe. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. I actually had no idea that they had elephant print ones at all. This is the first time I actually get exposed to it. Again, like most, the majority of you guys know already, I did start my sneaker, uh, my sneaker journey probably like 2018. So I'm still relatively new. So a lot of things are still new for me, but you know, for a for a couple of years that I've been doing this, it's, it's been pretty smooth, in my opinion. I think I've been catching up through a lot of stuff, but I'm still catching up and I'm still learning every day. So appreciate you guys because you guys always influence me as well. And you guys always teach me something new if I don't already know. That elephant is a must cop. Fire, fire, fire. Nice. Cop the nice essentials hoodie. Nice. Bad heck says, mine are faded, way better broken in. Ryan says, thoughts on the copy paste dunks? Question mark. I've never heard of those as well. Guys, have I been living under a rock or something? Copy and paste dunks. Copy and paste dunks. Dunk lows. I'm guessing it's a dunk low if it's. Oh, I have seen these. These are decent. These are nothing crazy. Nothing crazy. The scale of 1 to 10, I give them a solid 7. That's what I would get. That's a solid 7 for me. Um, let's see. Inho says, BG, I'm a size 10.5. Hey, me too. I'm Korean, so you know I want uh, I want the casinos. Well, how about this, Inho? Um, I'll definitely go for our size, size 10.5. I'll do a uh, review if I do end up hitting. And then I'll give them to you for retail price. Nonetheless, man. Shout out to Korea and them casinos. I would love to bless someone up with the retail shoe. Um, and that's what we're going to do, man. I want to hit for retail and give it out to the channel. So uh, to show some type of support for those that truly want a shoe and that didn't end up hitting. I'm here to support and I'm willing to do that. And um, I definitely will be doing that for Inho. So definitely going to go for a size 10 and a half and I'll let them go for you, man. For sure. Let's see. Dimitri says, Mr. 510 to 949. I share the opinions with you, fam. I think they look hideous. Uh, Chris Cubbing says, eh, the, these mid. Okay, understood. Um, I like the elephant print mids. I know the kids are not liked, uh, are not liked, but mids are my favorite ones. Highs are too highs and lows are, um, aren't my favorite. Understood. Trash can water. By the heck says, BG, I instant G'd a uh, pick for reference. Thank you so much for that, by the heck. Appreciate you a thousand percent. I should check out that DM after the stream is over. Uh, Zillow says, BG, would you recommend going for stage hazes for resale? No, Zillow. I would not go for stage hazes for resale whatsoever. Those might end up being bricks. Those might end up being bricks and probably going to be an easy mover, but I could see those being bricks. I would very much, very much watch out. Um, if you give me retail question, well, I'll send you the Panas 10.5s. They just arrived today because um, of your lives for free. Nice. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Well, you got it. You got it. We'll trade. It'll be a solid trade. I'm down for it. I'm down for it. Um, Eho17 says, my cousin was in S Korea and brought those flip old school bags. It's be quality. Sheesh. Sheesh. What says, when I hit on stuff... I can't help but sell it. I'm only 15, about $750 or $705 in my bank account. And I don't feel like I even uh, need to spend money and not get it back. I feel you that, fellas. I feel you that. Man, shout outs to you, man. You for being a 15-year-old and you're making money like this, that's a great, great look for you. And your future is looking pretty freaking bright. You're the, you're an entrepreneur in the making. 
If so, you are already an entrepreneur and I can see a bright future within that. Kina says, let's smash that like button and run it up, gang. What is up, Kina? What is up, Kina? Welcome back to the stream, guys. Appreciate you guys for tuning in as always. Uh, Tyler, I just now seen your comment. How come I have not seen your comment? Um, Tyler says, sorry, just got here. Did anyone get early access today? And did I miss anything super important? Question mark. So Tyler, exclusive access was given 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. A lot of people hit on the stream this morning was crazy, crazy, crazy. A ton of people hit. Um, as far as for those that missed out on exclusive access, they will be releasing again the 15th. Um, as far as the upcoming drops for tomorrow, there will be some casinos dropping tomorrow as well as the onyxes, the Yeezy onyxes that will be dropping tomorrow. So I'm going to give you guys the detail right now. So when it comes to Yeezy supply and confirm, those are going to have the onyx pairs for foam runners. We're going to be going from tomorrow. Hopefully we can hit. Um, as far as for casinos, they're going to be dropping on uh nike app or on the sneakers app i should say sneakers app retail price for the casinos will be about what 160 dollars and uh they should be profitable and they're going to be extremely hard to get i'm thinking that these might end up being kind of limited so just keep that in mind these are going to be a fan favorite going to be extremely hard and i would go from regardless of what size you guys should be doing just fine any size would be profitable in my opinion uh, but and welcome back to the stream, uh, Tyler. Thank you so much for tuning in as always. Elephant print one highs is a must. I did not hit. It's all good, Chris. Like we said, fifteenth will be a second chance, and I'm sure there's going to be plenty of raffles to go for the uh, for the infrareds. Ready Kicks says, "What's up, bro? New here. Welcome, 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 Ready Kicks. Appreciate you for tuning in. How'd you do this morning? Did you end up hitting? Did you end up hitting for the infrareds? Please let it be known in the chat." Um, 25%. Dang, that's a good number of us that hit. Yeah, definitely. Definitely. You got you guys should have seen it earlier. You guys should have seen it early. We were at like 36%. We were at like 36%. After the stream was over, I check out I checked out the percentage and there was about 36%. We were giving people out shout outs. We was giving out shout outs in the chat, guys, because I told everyone to send me a picture of their hit on their Gotham screen. And we placed them up on my Instagram and we just gave everyone shout outs. It was insane. It's a great time. Hopefully we can get the same exact vibe going on for tomorrow for the casinos. It's going to be probably a tougher call for the casinos and the infrareds, to be honest. Um, isn't Yeezy Supply heavily botted? It is, but it doesn't hurt to try. You never really know at days. Again, Yeezy Supply is my last resort, but usually it's very, very hard. Miles says, uh, what's up, new here? What is up, Miles? Welcome, welcome, welcome to the stream, guys. If you guys are new, make sure you guys subscribe, man. We do tend to go live every single day, and we do talk about the drops that are upcoming. If you guys have any questions, please let it be known in the chat. The chat and me are here to help out everyone. There's no such thing as a dumb question. And please, feel welcome, man. Tree lines are a great summer shoes, in my opinion. I think so, too. Tree lines are very nice. They're great quality, and they're undervalued. They're very much undervalued. Tyler says, let's go. Thank you for the recap. No problem, Tyler. We're always here to help, man. And I'm sure that everyone else over here would have said the same thing. So we're all here a team. We're all a family, man. Haven't won and confirmed yet, Sean. Don't worry. There should be a W waiting very soon for you, Sean. You got to be patient. I haven't won on confirmed since 2018. And I'm still going at it. I don't mind. I don't mind whatsoever. Uh, tell the 15-year-old, wait till he gets a girlfriend. Money gone. <laughs> <laughs> well that's the thing though um i think that it it depends it depends on where you have your priorities at if he has a girlfriend that's that early of age i never had a girlfriend that early of age i never committed to having a girlfriend so i was always on my type of time and i was always on my grind i was always trying to be on my school task um as corny as it sounds i did try to be as focused as possible because it's very easy to be distracted i'm sure he has a bright future i'm sure he's on the right path i think he'll be just fine i think fuss will do just fine even with or without a girlfriend doesn't matter um inho says anyone that's a new subscriber now you will not regret subscribing to this man thank you so much inho appreciate you a thousand percent will you be getting the stock numbers for the casinos uh where's bobby <laughs> bobby always helps out and even without bobby I usually do get the um the uh the uh stock numbers but bobby does help out a lot he does not have to but he always pulls up on the stream and he gives us the details when it comes to it so shout out to bobby those that know me know that bobby is my right hand man when it comes to the drops most of the time appreciate you guys that but everyone in the chat always helps out just as well 
and uh yeah guys thank you guys so much for tuning in and it's awesome that you guys know people that are within the streams as always it feels like we're all getting to know more and more of us and uh it's good it's good that we all know each other and that we can actually spend time together and become more uh more as a unit and as a team you know so that's always great Jacob says, I hit today on the fours on sneakers. I really don't wear suede new buck shoes. Might flip the infrared fours. Okay, not bad. Definitely would be a solid flip. And if you were to flip, make sure you do it uh, ASAP. Make sure you do it today. Not going to lie, I don't like the foam runners, but for $85, it would be my house slippers. Dude, those are going to be some expensive as um, house slippers for sure. But nonetheless, they're comfy. They're comfy and ho. They're comfy. Wealthy Jess, what's up, BG? What is up, Wealthy J? But heck says those are fire. I'd rock these in the rotation. No doubt about it. No doubt about it. Matter of fact, guys, hold on. Now that we brought up Bobby, I gotta give him a shout out too. Let me let me give Bobby a quick little shout out, man. Bobby, because I know he doesn't have uh I know he doesn't have Instagram and anything. I mean uh, he doesn't have a YouTube, but this is Bobby's Instagram. Um, if you guys want to give him a follow, I know he would want to follow uh, a, a shout out, and I gotta give it to uh, Bobby because he, he does show a lot of support to the channel. So he's also a member, a BG Kicks member, a family member. I know a lot of people up in here are BG Kicks family member. If you guys haven't already, please make sure you guys tune in on um, let's see, on our uh, BG Kicks family site, man. Check this out. You guys can join, and then you guys will be a part of the BG Kicks family, and all proceeds will be invested towards the channel to um you know help the streams out even more we will be getting a mic very soon i feel like by the end of this mic i mean by the end of this month i should have a setup for a mic so you guys can hear me out nice and clear and thank you guys so much for always tuning in but once again here's bobby shout out i do got to give it to him he does help out a lot he means a lot to me as well as much as everyone else in the chat as well um let's see so uh we got that um Buzz says, the wheat Travis Scott Air Max is going crazy. Congrats to the 10 people who hit on those. Facts. It's not a draw. Wait, what's not a draw, uh, Gerald? What's not a draw? For the casinos, they are a draw. Gray Morris says, did anyone hit on a size 13 on the infrareds? Does, uh, doesn't really want them. I want them for the toe, and I missed out. Well, if anyone has a size 13 for the casinos or the infrareds. Oh, no, for the infrareds. My apologies. Uh, Gray's willing to uh, Gray's willing to cop. Sean says, I just followed him. Nice. Thank you so much for that, guys. Um, that's why you go after the girls with big money and don't commit. Make them chase you and watch the money flow. <laughs> uh, Tyler says, is the gray Air Max more, um, more popular than the brown ones? Um, if so, why? Um, for the, for the um, are you talking about for the casinas, right? If you're talking about the orange pair, I think they're going to do just fine. I think they're going to do just fine. I think people are more towards this pair guys in the chat if you guys are watching right now which one would you guys pick out would you guys pick out the gray pair or would you guys pick out the orange pair please let it be known in the chat i actually want to i'm actually curious but i'm seeing a lot of people prefer the gray pair over this pair which is the orange pair i would prefer this pair over that pair but this pair is scoring on me i'm not gonna lie um roger says how much do you see the travis air max is going up for um as of right now uh they're probably doing decent numbers. I could see them in the future, probably hitting around the 600 to the 700 range. In the future, I'm not so sure when exactly, but definitely hit that time. They'll definitely hit that. Definitely hit that. It's an Air Max 1, so I could definitely have some potential going on. The gray is easier to wear. Gray. Uh, best Jordan 4 to buy for right now for resale as personal wouldn't would definitely be Military 4s. That's a fact. Orange ones are going for more on StockX. Kevin says, gray, gray. I'll take both. Nice. Yeah, I would take both too. Uh, but that's me being greedy. Um, I kind of like the orange pair more. Both are fire. Um, the kick push says orange, gray, orange. In Korea, a couple want these, so they'll always will be sought after um, equally. Nice. Yeah, it's it would be pretty dope. That's a pretty dope gesture to do. Matching with your loved ones. That would be awesome. Uh, gray Moore says, if possible. Both, if possible. Definitely. It's going to be extremely... It would be a miracle if you somehow picked out both of these on sneakers app tomorrow. That's insane. That's insane. Let's get it to 100 thumbs up. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. We got 99 thumbs up. Thank you guys for always showing up and always tuning in, guys. Appreciate you guys a thousand percent. This means a lot to me as much as I love spending time with you guys. And check this out. It's almost time to dip out, but not to worry because I'm still staying and I'm honestly very excited for tomorrow's drop. 
very excited for tomorrow's draw. I'm really hoping to grab a pair of one of these tomorrow. But if not, there's more dubs in the long run. Londy gray. I mean, Londy says gray. Boy wears the one color. Girlfriend wears the other color. Uh, Mark says, I'll grab the gray and put a big bang logo on him. <laughs> Lime says orange. By the heck says, I could have worn the gray yesterday with my gray and today with my blue jeans and blue hoodie. Nice. Tyler says, actually, I don't like that fur texture they got going on. That's the one thing I do like about them. I do like the fur texture going on. Uh, the pick, uh, the kick push 71 says, I'm not about easy W, uh, I'm not about easy W wear. I'm about fly to wear. Okay. Not bad. I like that. I like that. Buster the kid says core purple 2.0s are too expensive, but I want to get them. Should I pay resale or even try getting dot, dot, dot reps? Uh Oh, we're talking reps here. Here we go. So as far as for the core purple 2.0s, right guys? I don't see them restocking like that crazy. As far as, um, is it going to be a hard cop? Core purples are usually a very tough cop. If it's a white and purple colorway, they tend to do very well in the market. Um, I would say pay resale. If you guys go for reps, right? Reps don't really have much value because you can't sell it as the real deal. So I would suggest going for the real thing because at least when you guys um, sell the pair that you guys want to let go, you guys can make some actual money then to buy the reps but if you guys don't really care you guys can really do whatever you guys want with your guys money if you guys want to buy some reps as long as you guys know what you guys are getting into go right ahead for it it's a free country you guys can do whatever you guys please um nc blue nc blue jesse says i once hit two pairs of the sakai two colors on sneakers nice and nice that's a great look do you guys still have your guys uh sakai's i still have my sakai i think i got the black and yellow pair Still got the black and yellow pair. Let me see if I can search up how much they're going for. Sakai Waffles. I think that's, yeah, this one. The Undercover Collab. They did really bad. I was expecting them to go up, but I'm still holding on my pair. It's a great personal. Great, great personal. Um, let's see. Bugsy says, anyone hit a size 11 infrared or military black? I want for the toe. Um, I'm a size 10 and a half. If I did have an 11, I'll let you know. But as of right now, I'm just a size 10 and a half. What do you think about reps as a daily wear and not for collecting? If you guys want to wear reps, go right ahead. Um, I tend to look at shoes and, uh, uh, investment standing point and reps for me would not be the goal, the go to. But like I said before, as far as if you guys want to collect shoes, the real thing, and wear your reps, go right ahead. It's up to you guys. It's up to you guys. Who am I to tell you guys what to do and how you guys live your life? It's really up to you. Um, I just think that you're better off buying the real thing just because there's some type of value within that, within the brand, uh, within the real shoe. But again, live your life. Do whatever you guys please. I'm in no, no... Um, I'm, I'm no, nothing against people that wear reps. As long as you guys know what you guys are getting into, as long as you guys know what you guys have, that's fine by me. Um, let's see. Uh, which mic are you trying to get? Question mark. I've seen, I don't know what, which exact mic I'm trying to get, but I do know that I want it to, I think it's going to be like a hyper X. Um, I think this is the mic that I might end up going. I think it's like a quadcast. Quadcast hyper something hyper x yeah that's what it is right a mic like this something like that but i wouldn't not want to have it with color i would want to have it like um like an all black one so it just doesn't bother you guys so much would you guys care if the mic would be colorful or would you guys prefer it being black that's what i tend to do things based off of you guys i would want to do things so you guys could feel more comfy in the stream and you guys can hear me better i would think that you guys would want something all black so it doesn't keep on changing colors and whatnot but this is one of the the mics that i was looking at to get i just kind of have to find a way to like make sure the colors don't really pop on the stream so maybe i would have it like above me right here so you guys won't even look at the mic and i can just speak to you guys and i can just mute it whenever you guys can you guys can see my face instead of the mic itself but yeah very soon with all the donations that you guys been giving out it will be going back towards that mic so appreciate you guys 1000 percent. no matter what you guys are always showing support thank you guys so much for everything you guys be doing no doubt about it um i'm down to get loopy says tyler sup my brother my 10.5 brother what is up mr handsome 
Um, let's see. Classify says, also, we should get go to the city and get loopy. Definitely. Definitely, definitely, definitely. Classify says, you make a Discord. Should you make a... You should make a Discord, you say? If I am going to make a Discord, I'm definitely, definitely going to do one. But I need people to run the Discord with, man. For sure. For sure, I got to run a Discord with people. I can't just do it by myself. I feel like if I were to run a Discord by myself, it would be crazy crazy responsibility and that's a lot of stress and just doing things by myself if i am going to run a discord i need people that i can trust i need people that can get info out as fast as possible i am trying to provide disco for the people that's for free but if possible if that's not possible then it will be just a small little token but then again the whole point of me doing this is for people not to make discords so if i am going to make a discord it's going to be a little iffy for me to know when exactly i will be do making a discord but just know that first things first is this a channel will be for the people and i'm trying to provide as much info as possible and i'm trying to gather up as much people that are willing to share info for us to cop shoes and cop everything that we really want to desire so that's the whole point of this channel as well as just to uh, spread positivity while doing so at the same time uh, Messiah says only negative about reps is people are trying to sell them as real but if you can afford the real thing and you're happy with reps then who cares very nicely said yep I hit on the fours nice cap wait are you capping right now it says cap a lot pops are you capping right now did you hit on the fours or use that cap but congratulations those that uh do hit that did hit today congratulations cap if you didn't or if you did actually mr 510 says don't support fakes your money will go towards terrorism uh, growing legit says put a windsock on the mic. <laughs> Wait, what a windsock? Wait, how much is a windsock? I'll definitely be doing that for sure. Um, collab with Trevor on the Discord. I mean, that would be pretty dope. But then again, Trevor's doing his thing. I'm not trying to ruin whatever he's doing. If he ever does want to do a, a collab, that would be pretty dope. Then again, um, he's probably very busy. So I'm not really looking forward to doing any collabs as of right now, especially since people seem to be, you know, doing their thing. So I respect that. But if someone asks me to do a collab with them, um, if I'm messing with their vibe, if I if I mess with what they, st they stand for and they're positive with doing everything, then I'll definitely do a collaboration. Definitely would love to do a collab with anyone. Um, W's man for sure. Hey, bro, how do you feel about background music or instrumentals? I love them. I love them. I do try to make. Um, I am gonna try to provide more instrumentals for the uh, for the streams, but uh, everything seems to be very new to me, guys. Streaming is very new. Um, it's it's still a learning process for me. I started streaming about last month. I think last month or two months ago. Can't recall. I think it was like last month when I started taking streaming seriously for you guys. And um, I think it's the best thing that I've ever done. To be honest, I love what I do. I really do. I love going i love going live with you guys i love interacting with you guys sooner or later i will be providing a link for people to come in and say what's up in the chat and uh have their own little own little squared up right there so we can like look at each other and and like talk within the chat and i can have people within the chat come and uh say what's up say what's up and let us know how they feel about things you know i would want to switch things up like that for sure uh, Kamacha says, what's up, BG Kicks? What are your thoughts on the Jordan 1 low bleach coral? And are they a must cop for the rotation? Question mark. As far as for Jordan 1s in general, I think Jordan 1s are a great cop. Uh, bleach corals, if you're talking about stage hazes, because I think that's what they're called, right? Bleach corals, right? Let me see if I... Uh, bleach... Oh, my apologies, guys. Bleach coral. Jordan 1s. Let's see. Hold on. If you're talking about these right here, right, bleach corals, if they're considered the lows, if you're talking about these right here, oh, wait, are you talking about these? It says oral, bleach coral. Oh, snap, are you talking about these right here? These are kind of fire. I'm digging them. But if you were talking about stage hazes, I would think if stage hazes had a low, those would be a tough cop as well. But like I said, um, if you're talking about these, these are pretty fire. Then again, if Kamacha, if you're talking about something else, please let me know in my uh, in my DMs on Instagram and I can pull up the picture. No doubt about it. Uh, you're my favorite streamer. No cap. Thank you so much, Tyler. Appreciate you a thousand percent. Stage are different. Oh, OK, awesome. Awesome. Thank you for that cap. Uh, Kamacha says lows. Bleach crows, the lows. Bleach crow, the lows. Yeah, those lows. Awesome. 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 So, yeah, these are fire. These are definitely, definitely fire. I would definitely cop. When did they drop though? Have they not yet dropped? When did those plan on dropping? Let me know, guys. You guys, 
you guys must be doing more more research than I have been doing because it seems like you guys be be letting me know crazy crazy shoes that I haven't seen yet and they look freaking fire. They look freaking fire. All right, guys. So that's pretty much for the stream. I'm gonna be putting up the um, the links for the raffles. So um, if you guys want to wait and chit chat with you guys or um, wait and talk within the chat, you guys can also do that. I'm gonna be posting the links for you guys. Love you guys. I'm gonna be going live tomorrow for the morning drop as usual, guys. If you guys haven't already, make sure you guys subscribe to my Instagram. I do post all my story when exactly I will be going live. So make sure you guys subscribe and follow me on Instagram as well as on Twitter if you guys want. I will drop you guys the links right now. So uh, thank you guys so much for your patience, those that stayed. Thank you guys so much. Murder BX, the 17th, I believe. What is up, Murder BX? Thank you for the info. It sucks that I'm ending the stream because I'm just now seeing you, but I will be ending the stream now, guys. I'm going to be seeing you guys tomorrow morning. Thank you guys for always tuning in. Love you guys. Um, I'm going to drop the link for you guys for the... Um, for the raffles so um yeah guys i'm gonna see you guys very soon take care brush your hairs love you guys ha <laughs> ha